It's going to be another couple of months before I get to enjoy fresh peppers and tomatoes straight out of the garden. So I have been considering the idea of growing them indoors to get my fix a little earlier. So when Optic LED offered to send me their new GMAX 150 dimmable LED light, I knew this was going to be the perfect opportunity to try my hand at growing tomatoes and peppers indoors. Now I have a whole laundry list of things that I'm really excited about growing with this light, but I decided to start out with some peppers and tomatoes from Pan American Seeds new line of kitchen minis vegetables. Now this is a line of super dwarf veggies that can be grown in four to eight inch containers. And I thought this would be a perfect fit for growing indoors under this light. So the beauty of the GMAX 150 light is that unlike my typical T5 fluorescence that I use for seed starting, this light can be used for the entire growing process. So from seed to flower to fruit. The dimmable feature on this light ensures that you have control over the perfect amount of light for your plants at every given stage of growth. So let's take a closer look at this beauty of a grow light. What sets this light apart is the use of cutting edge horticultural LED technology. This light features 300 Samsung LM301H white LEDs and 12 LH351H bloom enhancing deep reds. At 3.10 micromoles per joule, the newly introduced LM301Hs now feature the highest photon efficacy among today's mid-power white LEDs. So basically in layman's terms, that means these LED whites are really efficient at producing a broad spectrum light. The LM301H LEDs encompass a broader spectrum of light from blue to green to red, which helps to promote balanced plant growth can enhance immunity from plant diseases, and can help the plants provide even greater nutritional value. Now to give you an idea of the coverage of this light, for vegetables at an 18 inch hanging height, this will cover a two by three foot area. And at a 24 inch hanging height, which is how I have this now, it will cover a two by four foot area. Now this light stays remarkably cool to the touch and that's because it has passive cooling from an overbuilt heat sink. The dimming capacity on this light goes from zero to 100%. The dial has increments of 25. It also has two controller ports for the optional optic LED master controller. And, and you can do some pretty cool things with that master controller, including setting this up to mimic natural sunrise and sunset. And I've included the full specs as well as a link to the manufacturer's website in the comment section below this video. So you can check those out if you're interested in more information. In the meantime, be sure to subscribe to catch all the updates of my plants growing under the GMAX 150 grow light. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.